Hey there, Clint Baker from Hillbilly Hippie Honeybees. Um, what I'm gonna do today is I'm inspecting a few nukes that uh, we have pulled out of one of our better queens. And I'm checking to see if the queens have taken. Um, I'm pretty sure that this one right here has taken. Um, but what I'm not sure about is if this one over here has taken. And if it has not taken, because the last time that I was in this, it looked like it didn't have a queen in it, didn't have any signs of a queen. Uh, so what I think I'm gonna do is, if that is still the case, is I'm going to combine it with that other one over there. Uh, that's a good thing about doing splits this time of the year. Uh, we, we did, uh, if they, the queen doesn't make it back, we've had a lot of bad weather like rain and cold and just up and down. And, and since she probably didn't get mated, it hasn't come back. Likely what I'll do is I'll just combine her over there. So uh, stick around, let's see what happens. That is the case. That one over there is queenless. Uh, where they've been queenless for so long, I'm just gonna go ahead and move them over here. Um, this one is queen right. I will find the queen again here and I'll show you that she is. There's all kinds of larvae in here, all stages of growth. So she's already laying. So she's already been out. She's already done her mating flight. And I don't know if you can see the larva in there or not, but maybe you can. What I'll do is I'll move these over and then I'll go get the ones that are queenless and put them in here and they will become sisters rather quickly. So let's look in here and see if we can find her real quick. I see all kinds of eggs. So she's in here, I'm sure, somewhere. Sometimes they're hard to find. Some like to run, some like to, especially these newer queens. Sometimes the newer queens are a little bit difficult to find because they like to run all over the place. But you would think, only being having few frames we can find her real quick There, there she is, right there. So. We'll go ahead and get them combined right quickly. So that they can start Their journey is making one brand new colony together.
So again, they are queenless. And how do we know? One, by the way they sound. And then two, they have nothing in here but pollen and nectar. So they should be accepted pretty easily. Um, I'm not too really worried about it either because the colony that we're putting this, combining them with is a really strong colony already. And so putting them in there is not going to phase either either one of these very good so you might ask well what is going to happen with the field bees that are over on the other side well they'll likely go into one of the colonies right next to them they'll drift over i'm not real worried about that either um, but we're going to combine two colonies here one with a queen and one without a queen two nukes that will uh be one big strong nuke and will be maybe even produce some honey uh, through the next flow but as you can tell here uh, they they are even producing some cells and there is no eggs no no any nothing in here that that shows me that they are queen right so, with that being said, you can see right here, I just put a, this, this one here is out of the one that was not queen right, this one is, and you can see there, there's nothing going on in here. There's no fighting, there's nothing going on. Matter of fact, I think they can tell that they have a new home and they're starting to fan and starting to, both both sides are starting to uh, work together here, it looks like already. So again, this is something you could do if you end up uh, having a queenless hive uh, from one of your splits. And if you have a, one that is, uh, that you can combine them with. So that's what we're doing here. And here is one day after uh, combining the two nukes, as you can see, they're getting along real well. Uh, there are bees on all frames, mainly over in here because this is where I put all the brood. But they're getting along real well. Things are going good in here. So that's how one way that you can uh, combine a queenless colony with a queen right colony. There are different ways, but this is one that you can use. Hope this helps you.